Hey YouTube, I'm about to change the belt in my Royal Commercial. Um, the belt snapped off and then the vacuum ate it. <laughs> I guess that shows what these things can do. Oh, there's Sammy Kitty again. Hey Sammy, Sammy, hey Kitty Kitty. She's, she's funny. Anyway, I'm about to change the belt, and I'm also going to smoke a cigarette. Haven't had one for most of the day. Um, well, I've had a couple, but I usually have maybe four or five each day. Yeah, it's not a major addiction for me. Um, and I just got this pack yesterday. Um, well, I have here with me my box of belts. Yes, I know, that's a Beyblade, um, case. I don't know what the hell they called them originally, because I don't play with Beyblades. Bay Whoops. Well, shit, my... A damn light just went off. Anyway, I hope you can still see that. Um, hold on, let me light my cigarette. All right. Um, this is a lot different than most of the vacuums I've serviced I have serviced Kirby's I've serviced Royals I've serviced almost any vacuum I can think of even the poo ear ones anyway like I said this vacuum ate the belt um, move this little flat like I did and hope that'll stay there um, turn over your vacuum and pull this bottom plate off. I don't know if I've showed a belt change for one of these or not. Um, you take your brush roll out and take your belt. Ah, Royal. This is a used belt, but it's still good. Um, actually came out of a, another Royal that I serviced, and I decided to put a brand new belt in it just to do an extra good deed. Um, put it in like so and you want to put it in right oops you should have an arrow uh, somewhere this should always point to the left side can't see it too well Anyway, this should always point to the left. I'm going to try and keep it right. Keep the end caps right. And you don't want it to be crooked. Now that that's in there, put all your, put your bottom plate back. Oh. 
Sorry, I'm trying to do this with one hand. It's not working out too well for me. Now, turn your vacuum back over and grip it from this side and pull it up over your motor shaft. <clears throat> Whoops. Hook it from the right. Well, the vacuum's right. And your brush roll a little turn to get the belt on there good or you can turn your motor spindle and you're back in business good to go and there's changing the belt in the Royal Commercial Model 1030 this is a good vacuum I rent this thing out all the time to people and it never comes back damaged so I mean I don't know if I told you what happened but in case I didn't now this is just in case I didn't tell you I was using it yesterday to clean up my um, what was I cleaning up again Oh yeah, to clean up my roommate's room, the belt snapped off and then the vacuum ate the belt. So it's probably in the bag somewhere amongst all the cat and dog hair. That this thing can pick up. This is a beast. And... I heard the I heard a snap. Roommate came home drunk. About to kick his ass. Anyway, I heard the belt snap. Then I heard it heard something go past the fan. I knew that was the belt. And then it and then when I shut it off um, I looked down to make sure it was the belt and sure enough it was the belt went into the vacuum and so I put this up and finished the job with the sanitaire but there it is. The only main servicing I had to do to this vacuum after all the times I rented this out was change the bag. And that was it. Never have I had to replace a fan. Never have I had to um, replace a brush roll. I haven't had to replace anything on this vacuum except for the except for putting a new bag in it. I've never had any major problems with this. So that should explain something about how good the quality is. These are loud, they're quieter ones, but this these commercial Royals are loud, but they are built like a tank. So, hope you enjoyed it. Bye.